damn, it's hot. It's hot as fat. What's up, Jazz Nation girls? Back with another motherfucking video for that ass, okay? I'm just not feeling my bum right now. So, no. Okay, y'all, so basically, by the time y'all already know what video I'm about to be doing today, and I don't, I haven't done this video, but I felt the need to do it, you know what I'm saying? So I just said, forget it. So I had put on my Instagram, basically, like, you know, with some assumptions that y'all have about me. And y'all, you know, was on some dick sucking shit. Like, say, no, I know y'all wasn't. Y'all really wasn't for real. Like, I, when I was looking at them, honestly, I thought I was gonna have like a lot of bad, you know, uh, bad comments or whatever. But apparently I didn't. Like, y'all must really love me. Like, hey. Y'all must really love me, but so I'm here to basically address y'all assumptions, okay? So make sure y'all give this video a big thumbs up, put in the comments, and tell me how cute the fuck I look, period. Say no, but tell me how cute I look, because I do look cute. Uh -huh. And I ain't got no makeup on, so yeah. But um, yeah, let's get into this video. Okay. So the first assumption is you're a goofy and fun person yes indeed i am a goofy person and i am also fun i love to have fun because i feel like why live to not have fun like life should be all about having fun you know what i'm saying like yeah <laughs> have fun with your life because you never know you know tomorrow's never promised so live every day like it's your last deep shit the second assumption is you think you're all that i mean i feel like every girl should have that confidence in herself to feel like she's all that you know even if you don't feel like you are that you should still be like bitch i'm all that in a bag of chips what are you talking about i feel like every girl should have that mindset you know what i'm saying like you're cute bitch you're the shit i feel like that okay if i feel like i'm all that then baby i'm all that okay the third assumption is everybody just staring at me today like do i really look fine as fuck like i got a story to tell y'all after this like after i'm done doing the assumptions i'm gonna tell y'all this story time bro like no joke it's hilarious why do you care what people think see it's like a little bit of half i do care then i don't you know what i'm saying that's something that i'm still trying to work on is to not care about what people think or what people gotta say and i'm starting to you know actually believe that it don't matter what you do you could do something good they still gonna talk you you could do something bad and they still gonna talk so why give a fuck you know what i'm saying so i'm still learning how to not care and it's going pretty well but i just feel like this would be a good video to do so i just said f it you know bring it on the next one is you're smart and have a good heart i'm smart believe it or not i can i can fool people by thinking i'm stupid you know but in real life i'm 10 steps ahead of everybody i'm smart as heck don't 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 let the cuteness or nothing fool you don't let my goofiness fool you or nothing thinking that i'm a dummy i'm smart okay and yes i do have a good heart sometimes i feel as though having a good heart really don't pay off you know what i'm saying treated so bold like i've been done so wrong and i just feel like dang you know I, if i have a good heart why do i get treated so messed up Maybe I should start being me. Maybe I should just play the bad girl role. Maybe people gonna start respecting me and appreciating me, you know? But then I said, what's that gonna do, you know? So, I feel like having a good heart would get you far in life, you know? So, I just let people screw me over because, hey, karma gonna get you. Not me. Look, I'm gonna remain the same, regardless. Uh, the next one is you keep everything 100. And you 100% right, okay? I keep everything 100. Like, I'm as real as it gets. Like, I'm just a real ass freaking chick. I'm a real ass friend. It don't even matter what type of friendship, relationship. I'm real as heck. Like, I'm just real, period. And I always keep stuff on it. Cause like, why why lie? You know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't gonna hold y'all up. I be lying about little stuff. <laughs> I, be lying, like, I be lying about the most dumbest stuff. Like, if you ask me like, Jazz, did you eat? I say no. Or if you be like, is that your last bag of chips? I say, yeah. You know when I got like five bags of chips in my bag. Ooh, like I lie like that like Jess you got a dollar I'd be like dang bro I don't but I got like 20 because I'm trying to save it for me I lie about little stuff like that nothing major though if you ask me come to me about some real junk I'm gonna keep it real with you for real for real but ask me did I eat the last piece of chicken 
I'm lying. <laughs> I'm lying, period. I did eat that chicken and I tore it up. <laughs> uh, the next one is, you still have love for Tay deep down. I was gonna skip over this, but then I said, what the hey? You know what I'm saying? Yes, I still have love for Tay. He was my best friend. We were engaged. You know, we were together for damn near four years. He's the father of my child. We had a bond. We, we you know, we, we built something together. Um, yeah, I still have love for Tay, you know what I'm saying? He's gonna always have a special place in my heart. The next one is you underestimate yourself when it comes to how beautiful you are. I do feel like I underestimate myself sometimes. Um, I'm still trying to learn I'm still trying it's just a lot of stuff that I need to work on about myself and that's why I'm kind of happy that I am single because now it's like I don't have to focus on another person because when you're in a relationship you tend to forget about yourself and that's what happened with me honestly I was so worried about you know the person that I was so worried about you know my man that I totally forgot about myself I wasn't taking care of myself I was walking around any kind of way I didn't get my hair done when I should I didn't get my nose and feet done I I just ain't buy new clothes you know because I wasn't worried about myself I wasn't focused on myself and you know when you're in a relationship you know you tend to forget about yourself so that's what happened so now since i'm single i'm focusing more on myself i'm getting myself together a bitch getting her nails and feet done every month every freaking week you know i'm you know i'm, I'm still trying to find my my style and clothes you know what i'm saying I'm, I'm still trying to figure that out but new drip is coming so you know yeah little stuff like that you know i kind of do you know, underestimate myself, but I'm gonna pick myself up. Believe it, I'm gonna pick myself up and y'all gonna see the difference. Y'all gonna be like, oh shit, she really, she's stepping the fuck up. What does assumptions mean? Oh baby, that's what Google is for. Go on Google and you type in assumptions definition and it'll tell you, period. Uh, the next one is you need a relationship. One. Thing y'all need to know about me is Jazzy don't need no relationship. Jazzy don't need no man. You know, yeah, it's good to have a man on the side, someone that you can depend on, someone that you can count on to be there. You know what I'm saying? It's always good to have that soulmate, your best friend. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I don't need a man. I don't need friends. I don't need, technically, I don't need nobody to make me happy. I mean, my daughter makes me happy, period. That's my happiness right there. But you talking about I need a man? I don't need no man. But the next one is you don't realize your worth um no i'm not gonna i'm not gonna hold y'all up i keep everything 100 like i told y'all i don't realize my worth and that's my problem i need to realize it now that i'm you know by myself i be in a room you know by myself so it's like i be i really think about stuff like that i be thinking like what do i what do jazz really deserve you know what i'm saying and I'm starting to realize what I do deserve. That's why I'm accepting so much as to what happened, you know? I'm not dwelling on that situation no more because it's like I understand it and I'm moving forward. And it's like, as I'm moving forward, I'm realizing what I deserve. I'm realizing my worth. And you know, I'm, I'm happy. I'm proud of myself, you know what I'm saying? I'm proud of myself. So that's really all the assumptions. It's, it's a lot more, but I just felt like, no, that's doing too much too many but um i was gonna tell y'all about the story time about you know that there's one thing i'm a jig but i'm gonna tell y'all that next next video because that's some juicy shit ladies y'all gotta stay tuned for that dudes y'all probably don't want to listen to it dudes y'all probably don't want to hear it but let me tell y'all something ladies <laughs> i'm gonna see y'all in the next video because that's some juicy stuff like dudes really be crazy for real so i'm gonna see y'all next video give this video a big thumbs up if y'all want a part two spell it up in the comments don't forget to get this <laughs> don't forget to turn on your post notifications and click them bells huh don't forget to turn on your post notifications okay forget i said the other part but um yeah just make sure i love y'all and i'll see you next video <laughs>